I have today is the newest Geek Fuel August 2021 mystery box. So this is around 25 bucks a month. It is a cheaper price point mystery box. If you're into some geeky goodness, this box might just be for you. So Geek Fuel used to do their quarterly boxes, which I love those, but they went back to the monthly box, I think early last year. And some of these boxes are hit and miss. Some have been fantastic. Some have left me desiring more, but it's a cheaper price point. And on this YouTube channel, I review mystery boxes a lot of the time. So I keep this subscription going just because some people would like to see what is in these boxes. And then you make your decision if you want to subscribe or not. You know, you can base it on my opinion, and then you can also can form your own opinions on what you think you should spend your money on. If it's not Geek Fuel, there's a lot more subscription boxes out there. zobi has got a pop culture box. Bam's got kind of like a pop culture type of box. You've got other, I'm trying to think, whatever boxes do I have, like pop culture. Culture Fly, I think they've got several pop culture boxes. They, they've even got theme boxes. Actually, I actually have one back here. I've got the newest, the Office box, which I'll do that in here sh shortly, probably, hopefully. But here we go. Let's crack open and see what we got this time. So with this box, don't expect any kind of autographs. You're not gonna get any autographs. There's no like prop replicas. I know like with Zobi, they give you a JSA autograph in every box. They give you prop replica, really cool t-shirts, pins. So you can't expect the greatness of a Zobi box in a Geek Fuel box. But the price point's very, very low on this. So your, my expectations are a lot lower, <laughs> you know? If you're on top, I feel a t-shirt. Yep, actually it's soft very soft shirt let's see what we got the back actually has or no that's that's the front so there's the front of the t-shirt and then here's the back of the t-shirt what size did I even get 3xl there's the back of the t-shirt I'm guessing this is probably just a Geek Fuel exclusive t-shirt probably they're playing off of maybe some video game franchise I'm really not 100% sure, but I do like the shirt. It's extremely soft. It actually is Geek Fuel branded t-shirt, so it's made just for the Geek Fuel mystery subscription box, a Geek Fuel exclusive. So I do actually, I, I'm not sure what the shirt is, but I do like it because it's a very soft, comfortable shirt. And I do like some soft shirts sometimes to wear, so actually I'm gonna keep the shirt. That's gonna go into my shirt rotation. Actually, just recently, I've gone through probably 200 t-shirts of mine, and I cleaned out at least 50, maybe 75, and those are actually listed right now on my eBay store. So, if you're looking for some bigger size t-shirts, I mean, some big boy size t-shirts, I think I've got 2X up to 5X. Check them out, because uh, I got some pretty cool shirts. I got pop culture, I've got comic book, I got wrestling. If you're interested, if you're, if you're a bigger guy that wants to get some bigger t-shirts, eBay store, draw a link down below in the description box for this video. Let's see, what is this? We have, oh this, that's the cheat seat. So this is called the Squads of Summer. Then coming this fall, it says they got Ghostbusters, Mondo, Harry Potter, and more. Interesting, we'll do the cheat sheet very, very last. Okay, next item, oh, we got Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman scented candle. Is this a Geek Fuel exclusive? It doesn't say. I don't think it is. They probably just, you know, ordered a bunch. Well, it smells nice. This day, Wonder Woman send a candle. The scent is. I can't place it, honestly. Yeah, it's pretty different. It's not bad. I mean, it's usable. Here we go. What is the. Oh, I think we got the monthly pin here. The back says Suicide Squad lapel pin set. Is this from the new Su Suicide Squad movie coming out? And I think it is. The pins kind of shifted a little bit. We got Deadshot, Enchantress, and a Boomerang on this. So it is a three pack pin. I don't think Geek Fuel ever has like chase variations of pins. Some subscription boxes will have like chase variations that you can get out, but we have three lapel pins. I'm sure that this is actually based on the first Suicide Squad movie. Surprised they didn't put in a Harley Quinn pin. I mean, since she's very, she's one of the most popular characters in the DC universe is Harley Quinn. 
but I just know Harley Quinn. But maybe they're actually trying to branch out a little bit and get people to realize like Enchantress, Boomerang, Deadshot, that they themselves are pretty cool characters. But the new Suicide Squad movie is coming out soon. It's not out yet, is it? I think it's coming out soon. I'm not sure when it's actually coming out. Like the exact date, I'm not too sure. Let's see, next item. We have a collectible figurine, it looks like. We have the Good Feathers from Animaniacs. This is a Q Fig Max. That's pretty cool. I know in the past they've done Q Figs of Batman, they've done Superman. I think there was also an Iron Man that they put into their past subscription boxes. This time we got an Animaniacs Good Feathers. So I'm not an Animaniacs fan, something like this I actually will sell in my eBay store. So if you're looking for something like this, if you're a collector, I've got one for you. It will be available for sale. Box is actually like mint condition. They had it all wrapped up nice and neat. No damage, no scratches, no nothing. It's a fantastic shape. I think that might have been the last thing, and it was. That is the inside of an empty subscription box. So that thing had, what, four items in it. Which is pretty much standard, you know, for a $25 box. You can't expect the box to be just jam-packed full of stuff because you're not paying... 50 bucks for this box, you're paying $25. I think it's actually $25 shipped out the door. Here we go with the cheat sheet. Squads of Summer. Take a little look at it. Open this thing up. First page. The Good Feathers, our favorite squad of mobster penguins, strut down a New York City sidewalk in this charming Q-Fig Max of the popular characters as seen in the TV series Animaniacs from Warner Brothers Animation. So that's pretty cool. It's actually, they're, they're giving this a, a value of $30 on it. Hmm. Probably more like 15, maybe as high as 20. It all depends on, you know, I don't really know. This was made in 2017, so it might not be available in stores anymore. I don't really know. 30 bucks is a little high. I say more probably about half of that value. Then we got the Right Hand of Doom exclusive t-shirt. At the Bureau of Paranormal Research and Defense, you are bound to run into some interesting characters, although the Prino fan favorite is the big red demonic beast turned superhero with the right hand of doom. Enjoy this exclusive t-shirt depicting the Bureau's iconic logo reimagined on the back and a subtle red right hand on the front that, that your fellow geeks will respect whether you're on an assignment or relaxing with a fresh cigar. $20 value. T-shirt, 20 bucks. That's actually a very fair price. You go to Hot Topic t-shirts there, $20, $25. 20 bucks is a fair price. Then we got Suicide Squad pins. And it actually looks like there was several that were possible. Suicide Squad enamel pin three pack. Receive one of the three sets. Super villains unite or at least pretend to get along with your fellow Elite Strike Force team members while taking on dangerous covert missions. Each of our Suicide Squad lapel pin sets includes three richly enameled designs that are based on artwork straight from DC Comics Design Vault. So the set one, which is what I got, had Deadshot, Enchantress, and Boomerang. Set two had Killer Croc, Katana, and Diablo. Set three had Rick Flag, Harley Quinn, which I was made to make a Harley, and then you had Slipknot. So there was three different sets, nine total characters. As I was saying, I was so surprised there wasn't a Harley Quinn, and there actually was one. Then last, there is a DC Comics scented candle. Receive one of four. You can get Wonder Woman. Poison Ivy, Catwoman, or Harley Quinn. I think the best two to get out, personal opinion, would be Wonder Woman or Harley Quinn. So that is it for the August 2021 Squads of Summer. It was kind of like what? DC themed Doom, Animaniacs, and actually DC DC. Two out of four things were actually were DC themed. So all in all, for 25 bucks, I think it was a good value. One thing from this box I'll probably honestly keep is going to be the t-shirt because I think it's just a super soft t-shirt. I like I like the shirt. Figure for, will be for sale in my eBay store. Candle. Actually, my wife might use this actually in the house. The pins will be for sale in my eBay store because I don't collect pins. And a lot of people out there do collect these kinds of pins. They have pin boards with a huge collection on them. They put their pins on them, but just not for me. Not something that I ever would want to actually collect myself. You make your opinion on this. Would you buy this for 25 bucks? Yes or no? Comment down below. Let's see what people think. See you next month.